Hey guys, what's up? By Sectatron here from One Hive Gazette. Here with the next video, and this one is a quick one about Town Hall 11. I wanted to give a few thoughts on it as we take a look at this uh, three star here. Talk a little bit about uh, kind of the defensive setup we're looking at uh, going into the future, and also what kind of attack uh, power we're going to be seeing, just how they're going to play out in wars in general, especially the CWL type wars with those kinds of weights, because CWL is getting heavier, especially some of the, uh, like the CWL invite, some of the top tiers of CWL. So um, as we have Wicked One in the background, kind of a weird account, I guess this has low level heroes, but um, has the max ward, and so kind of interesting there. Uh, but um, Town Hall 11 right now is definitely in kind of a, I think kind of a transition point because as soon as we see the Town Hall 10s start to get three starred in war, and it's coming, trust me, Town Hall 10s soon will start to get three starred in war, like all of them, I mean by that, Town Hall 11s are next. And the only reason we haven't seen any kind of large amount of Town Hall 11 three stars in most wars is... Uh, the reason they're occasional as of right now in most wars is because there's still Town Hall 10s that are, aren't getting cleaned up typically. There's usually one, two, three Town Hall 10s. Uh, there's especially the max ones that aren't getting three starred. And right now, dip attacks much more reliable. Town Hall 10 v Town Hall 10 much more reliable. We're seeing a lot more three stars on Town Hall 10s. And as soon as we get to that threshold where Town Hall 10s are going to be somewhat consistently three starred, in every war, all of them, that's opening the door for Town Hall 11. And bases like this one that you just saw with these air defenses, you know, kind of towards the outside a little bit, but not really doing much, they're still in the four corners, those are not going to be viable anymore. We're going to start seeing Town Hall 10 tactics at Town Hall 11, especially for um, mid to low level Town Hall 11s, but even max Town Hall 11s. The air defense is all on one side of the base with the queen on the other, different inferno placement. We're going to start seeing stuff like that at Town Hall 11 very soon. So my recommendation for you guys is for your Town Hall 11s and your clan, start to transition to some kind of Town Hall 10-ish type bases, the anti-three-star bases at Town Hall 11. Um, I'm going to do my best to cover Town Hall 11 a little bit more as it's becoming more of a viable three-star Town Hall level. So you guys will probably see some more action. I know this has been a quick video, but I just wanted to give a few thoughts, kind of a PSA to Town Hall 11, so to speak. Um, it's um, Town Hall 11 v Town Hall 11 three-stars are going to start deciding wars, and they kind of been doing that already to a certain extent. We're seeing Town Hall 10 start to get cleaned up more and more. The next uh, progression is those Town Hall 11 three stars. So uh, I re recommend practicing it and get familiar with this Laloon because uh, it seems to be the only viable strategy or at least the best as of right now. So thanks for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Sorry it's a little bit short, I know, but um, I'll do my best to get the video some videos out tomorrow, the next day, and going into the weekend. So that should be good, and I'll see you guys then. Bye, Sectatron out.